Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're gonna to do a 10 minute booty band burnout workout. Make sure that you have your booty band ready to go and make sure that you can see your screen so you can follow along with me. And without further ado, let's get to it. All right guys, first up, we are going to start off with some side steps. You're gonna hinge at your hips. Your upper body is slightly leaning forward and we're feeling the resistance on the band, stepping from side to side. head work. Next up, we are going to do just some regular banded squats. So feet are a little bit further than shoulder width. You're gonna come down, making sure that you're feeling the resistance in your band and not letting your knees cave inward. You wanna push against that band. Knees are pressed outward, coming all the way down, sitting into those heels and coming up. We're also not hinging our hips at the top. We're staying slightly forward with knees slightly bent. So our glutes are the focus. Good. One more variation of squats before we head down to the ground. You're gonna do, we're gonna kind of combine the two. So you're going to step to the side, come out for a squat, you're gonna pulse, bring it in. Feel the resistance, out into a squat, pulse, and up. Make sure you're coming all the way down in your squat. Good work, coming down to the ground. We're in a tabletop position. We're gonna do some banded donkey kicks. We're gonna do 30 seconds on each leg. When you're doing this donkey kick, we're gonna do a pulse at the top. So you're gonna bring it up, feel that squeeze, pulse, pulse, bring it in. Think about sending your heel to the ceiling. Think about sending that right hip down to the floor. Good, we're gonna switch legs right away, no rest. Keep a nice neutral spine, don't arch that back. Good, we're taking a 15 second rest. Next up, we're gonna come back into that same position. This time we're gonna do fire hydrants. So we're sending our leg out to the side. So you're gonna think about lifting that knee, squeezing that side glute, and bringing it in. Make sure that your core is nice and tight.
Good, switching legs right away. Try not to let that upper body move, just focus on using that working leg. Good, coming down on your back. Next up, we're gonna do some glute bridges. Nice and simple, just banded glute bridges. But I want you to focus on feeling the resistance on the band, and I want you to feel that the whole time. Also remember to press that lower back into the floor as you come down, so we're protecting that lower back and pressing those hips all the way up. Weight is in our heels. So don't let those knees cave inward and press those hips all the way up to the sky. Good, 15 second rest. Next up, we're going to do some lying abductions. So, legs are bent. You're gonna bring your knees in closer to your chest. Lower back's pressed into the floor and all you're gonna do is open the knees and close. So you're really gonna feel that in those outer glutes. Make sure you feel that squeeze before you bring it in and control on the way in. Good, quick rest. Next up, you're gonna do a glute bridge with an abduction, so we're combining the two. When you do your glute bridge, you're sending those hips all the way up, and without dropping your hips, you're going to open the knees, close, and bring them down. Here we go. Good work, let's stand it up. Next up, we're gonna do a squat. At the top of your squat, you're going to lift the leg to the side. So you're coming down, as you come up, you're going to lift the leg to the side, down for a squat. So we're kind of doing that same fire hydrant motion, we're just standing up. Make sure you're not letting those knees cave in as you come down for your squat. Good. Our last exercise is going to be the same thing, except we're going to kick to the back instead of to the side. So you're gonna do a squat, and as you come up from your squat, bring the leg in, kick it to the back, center, squat. 
down, kick it to the back. Make sure you feel that resistance on the band as you kick back. You're sending your legs straight to the back, not on a diagonal, not out to the side. Straight back, kick that back wall. That is it guys. Great job. I hope you enjoyed this quick 10 minute booty band burnout. If you did, give this video a thumbs up for me. Let me know how you did in the comments down below. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notifications so you don't miss another video from me and I will see you guys very soon. Bye.